All right, room. here's what we're looking at. This is called a hemisphere. It's half of a sphere. So if I was going old school and trying to find the surface area, I would have to take half of the surface area and then I'd have to add on like kind of the cover for this piece. But I give you a formula for this. The formula for the surface area of a hemisphere, it's on your formula sheet. It just, it becomes 3 pi r squared. So it's super straightforward. Here's the radius. Bam. 3 pi times 12 squared. Now, let's check out the directions. Round to the nearest hundred. So I'm going to park that pi. Well, actually, I'm going to put it all in. 12 squared times 3, or do the 3 first, doesn't matter, times the pi. I'm going to get this as a decimal because it wants to round to the nearest hundredth. 1,357 point. It's 168, so that becomes 17 centimeters squared. Booyah! Do you really need my help? I don't know. Okay, now let's talk about the volume. The volume, you would just find the stuff that goes on the inside of this hemisphere. That's what volume is. So it's half of the regular volume formula, which just becomes two-thirds pi r cubed. All right. So two-thirds pi 12 cubed. So two divided by three times pi times 12 to the third power is going to give me as a decimal, turn into a decimal, 3,619. It's 0 0.114, so 0.11. Hey, don't forget, volume is units cubed. All right, there you go. Problem number five, check.